Hello space fans, I'm stuck in traffic. So, what I'm going to do is talk about astronomy to distract myself and prevent myself getting road rage. Did you know that earlier this week astronomers have announced the discovery of the first Earth-sized planet orbiting a habitable zone? Crap, I didn't make the light. Now I have to wait the whole time around. Uh, from which the star, uh, that liquid water can be present, uh, from that star and blah 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 Anyway, after 11 years of observing in telescopes in Hawaii, they've discovered a planet orbiting Gliese 581, a red dwarf star that is much smaller and much cooler than the Sun. The planet that they've discovered is not only is it the size of the Earth, roughly, it is also within its habitable zone. That's the distance from the star that would allow liquid water to be present on the planet. Oh goody, I get to go now. Its orbit is only around 40 days, very fast a year. It orbits very quickly around the star, but because the star is so cool, uh, the habitable zone is much, much closer to it than the habitable zone of the sun is. So, um, I mean, the Earth is obviously within the habitable zone of the sun, and we're 93 million miles away. This planet is much, much closer to its parent star and still, allow, and still allows it to have liquid water. Pretty cool discovery, and I wanted to share it with you. I put a link to the video where they made the announcement in the description box below, so go check it out. Another really cool discovery that you can make, on an unrelated note, is if you go to my channel, I have activated what is known as the YouTube Moderator Module. And this nifty little device allows me to allow you to interact on my channel by giving me suggestions and ideas for videos. And I would like you to go do that because as space fans, you have really good ideas. My last two videos, for example, were based on space fan ideas. Why is the sky dark at night? And a journey into a black hole were both videos I made in direct response to your suggestions. So I'd like more of those. But more than that, I would like you to also go and vote on other people's ideas. That's what this moderator module lets you do. Make a suggestion and vote on what you see there. Whichever is the most highest voted ideas and suggestions, I'm going to use, or I'm going to use to, as an idea or as impetus for the next video. And I'll keep doing that for as long as you're willing to give me ideas. So please, go to my channel, enter in some suggestions. Everybody else, if you don't have a suggestion, vote on everybody else's, and I'll take a look at those and make the next video based on that. Um, I think it would be pretty good. Well, that's it for now, space fans. I'm on my way home, still stuck in traffic. <sighs> Maybe I'll get there before it gets dark. I don't know. Anyway, thanks for watching, and as always, keep looking up.